Okay, Mrs. Wong bought some shirts at $9 each and sold them for $20 each. From here, from the first sentence, you know that she is already making a profit, right? Because she bought, bought it at a low cost price and then she sell them at a higher selling price. You know what's a cost price and selling price, right? This is called the cost price. This is called the selling price because it's sold selling price customers who bought two shirts were given one shirt for free she earned a profit of 335 dollars and she gave away eight shirt this eight shirt is the free t-shirt just now because if a customer come and buy two t-shirt right she will give one for free buy two get one free that kind of uh, sale okay how many customers bought only one shirt one shirt because usually if a customer buy two she will give one free but i just want to know how many bought only one shirt okay let's do this question this is a profit question okay so everything is about profit she's earning a profit but then she actually divide the profit into a certain sale te technique right where she have two shirts so she gave one shirt free that one okay we focus on that part first so profit earned for one shirt Profit earned for one shirt. So for profit and loss or discount question, right? Please label. You can see my labeling, right? I do this. I write down the label. I write down that statement, what it is representing. What am I trying to find? So when your marker mark, she can actually quickly see what you're trying to explain there in that question. Okay? So $20. Minus nine dollars. Where do I get this from? This one, the first sentence. So her profit is actually generally eleven dollars. Okay. So if a customer bought two t-shirts, so two shirts means she earn a profit. Profit for two shirts means eleven dollars times two. So it is twenty-two dollars, right? For this one. Okay. Then profit. Earn from each customer who bought two shirts. Now I'm looking at this. Equal to, so you know those customer actually bought two shirts given one free. Okay, so the two shirt is $22. Take away the one shirt that she bought at $9, right? So it is $13. So her profit is $13. Those who buy two shirts. Okay. So total profit from customers who bought two shirts equal to my total profit is since I gave away eight shirts, that is the 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 sales technique right here right means i give whenever a customer buy two shirts i will give one shirt free so i want to know how many it uh, i earn from that from that sale okay so i take two times not two the, the 13 dollars the one that i find here this one here so the 13 dollars from the two shirts times my eight t-shirt eight shirts equals to $104. Okay, not done yet. Huh? So now from here, I know that this is my total profit I get from the customers who buy two shirts. Now I want to buy, I want to find profits from customer who bought one shirt equals to, you take the 335. This is my total profit. 335. You take away what I know from the two t shirt customer 104 equals to 231. Okay, so from there, can I find out how many of them bought only one shirt? Can so I take 231 divided by my normal profit and I will get 21. So 21 customer bought the one shirt. Right? 